Here we are for the first game of the third match. This hand doesn't have an end, uh, one, turn one engine, but I think I'm gonna keep it anyway. Mm, I guess this, again, I really want this deck to have a Druid Arbor, but probably Druid Arbor would just get hit by, you know, something. Uh, let's play. If it's not so I don't know what we are exactly playing. Uh, yeah. I need a land or uh, one mana engagement. Or two mana engagement. Color balance, okay. This is gonna be hard. Uh, Thrashington doesn't count as a land because it doesn't give any mana. I think I'm gonna get white white mana in case I draw like a two mana white. What does he reveal? Land. And does he have force? Yeah, he has force. Exiles. Brainstorm. Okay. Yeah, well, I was talking about. I mean, fetching up planes in case I draw something on a crest in peace. So I feel quite dead here. But I guess it takes him a while to kill me. And even though he probably has a way to deal with two mana, he probably doesn't have that many ways to deal with three mana. This is why I wish I had a land, because now I would be casting a three mana spell. Which is a much higher chance of resolving. Okay, well at least Record Anderson might resolve. So he's taking a while to think, so probably doesn't result. Probably does result. Yeah, okay. So now I just need a land. I mean seriously. Land. Or one mana one mana engine which draws me a land, which would be nice also. One mana engine probably doesn't resolve, but at least it does draw me a card. Hmm. So it's just <coughs> He's looking for something good. And then another since it's wind up. So that. Thank you. So I'm gonna cast Enchantress for a sense because if I cast Greenstone Cynic for another Arcosian, uh, I don't get a card and he might have Terminus. That would be so I'm gonna cast this. I get a card and if he gets covered then at least I got a card. Okay. Well this that would have been countered that way in any case. <coughs> Not a crash. Draws me cards at some point, most likely. He has no cards left in hand and he's looking for things. So I'm just hoping he doesn't find a dream and a ghost, at least in the sense that I hope he doesn't find an entry to angels. Okay, terminus. This is actually fine for me. I think I'm gonna cast screens on Zenit. And hmm. Yeah, that doesn't resolve, so let's cast screens on scene. Hope he doesn't have a tree on top. Because if he has a tree on top, I think I lost since if he's smart enough to keep the tree on top all the time. Okay, good, he doesn't, so I still have a chance. And let's play that.
So, I'm going to nice, but let's cast instant first person. Hope he hasn't found a tree again. Tree is the, co the number that it's the hardest for them to find, but it's there, so let's see how lucky I get. So, no tree. Draws a card, so that's a brainstorm. Or a spell pierce. Counter spell, well, that's annoying also. So, yes, I would love to have Incentors presents on the battlefield. Well, that's again. I would rather have Incentors present than another Archoldian Incentors since I want mana from my Zero Sanctum. So, as long as as long as he doesn't find a tree on top of his deck and he doesn't find the Jace, uh, I think we are still in the game. As soon as Jace or a tree mana goes spell joins the battle, uh, the battle, I end up losing the battle. So again, I think I'm gonna go with Entities. That's the one card I want on top of my, in my deck. Again, counter spell, a spell pierce. It's not just a, <laughs> spell beers, flashbacks, they are not even flashbacking on the spell. Oh, let's move the card. So let's draw a card. Land is always good. Uh, I think I'm gonna cycle a Utopia Sparal here. I will get countered, but at least I'm gonna cycle it. Okay, so. I guess the next turn I no longer have a choice, I need to cast Crimson Zenith. For our Colian Enchanters. And then hope he doesn't have Terminus. Oh, yeah, also need to hope that he doesn't have a 3 mana costing spell. No tree on top. I think it goes by the tree, not the one. No. Okay, now he found the tree, so I'm gonna actually lose this game now. I guess now he gets rid of the tree, so I might still have a chance. No, it. Okay, he gets rid of it by getting three angels that kill me in. Not in one attack, but two. So I think I still have an out. If I draw on solitary confinement, yeah. If I draw a solitary confinement, and he doesn't, he shouldn't have a tree again on top. So I need to draw a solitary confinement. Yeah, that's like the one card that can help here. One and only card that can help is Solitary Confinement. Card Optic. Starting off. So I guess I can still cycle all of and crash here. I can still top deck Solitary Confinement. And with the land, I can still drop top deck solid icon fun. I guess I should have fetched first in case. So I think. No, I'm dead. 
So I like Gadok Dig here. I like Carpet of Flowers. I kind of like Joke. Oblivion Ring seems okay again. Also, I think I want to get rid of the Solidary Confinements. I don't know how much enchantment destruction they are have, so maybe throw away Sterling Grove. Uh, probably don't need this combo here. Since Russian Peace is otherwise pretty bad against him. And that leaves two spots with the first Pony Silence or Sterling Grove. Okay, Elephant Crest out also, which means that I'm gonna get a few of these. I think I'm gonna try like this. Like, yeah, I could take something like Solidary Confinement in case he gets lots of angels. But I'm gonna hope he doesn't get them fast, that it takes him time to get them. In. And I will be able to go off before that. Hmm. Not sure, maybe I should have one solitary confinement in my deck. Nah, I'm gonna try like this. Yeah, I'm gonna try like this. I will see you in the next game.